The recent expansion of the House Judiciary Committee's probes into President Donald Trump is more about aiding the Democrats in 2020 instead of seeking the truth, argued Townell. Com News editor Katie Pavlik on Monday. The committee announced that it sent 81 letters to various members of the Trump White House campaign and business with a request for documents. During the special report All Star panel, Pavlik, Fox News politics editor Chris Steerwald, and Democratic strategist Jim Messina weighed in on the political impact the House Democrats' probes into the president will make going forward. Pavlik began by insisting that the ball has been moved completely off of the field after Democrats have pivoted away from wanting to know about Russian collusion. There is a proper role for Congress to play when it comes to oversight. However, this is not about investigating government scandals like Operation Fast and Furious or the IRS targeting of conservatives, this is about going after President Trump personally and using Congress and House committees with subpoenas to open up a treasure trove of opposition research for 2020 candidates," Pavlik said. And the truth is that impeachment might be good in a primary, but it's not going to be good in a general election. Messina told the panel that Democrats are being very careful in regards to impeachment, saying they've learned the lesson from Republicans after they impeached President Bill Clinton in the 90s. It's the balance of power in the House is going to look very deep into this stuff and they should, Messina said. Meanwhile, Chris Steerwalt says people should keep a prayer and keep some sympathy for House Judiciary Chairman Jerry Nadler, D. New York, because as serious as he is, many in his party are much more radical and aggressive when it comes to Trump's impeachment. Nancy Pelosi, Jerry Nadler do not want to impeach Donald Trump unless they absolutely have to. They'd rather just beat him in 2020, Steerwalt said.